Yo guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to create this cool texture transition effect. So I haven't really seen this effect done at all to be honest with you. So anyway, let's get right into the effect. So guys, first of all what we're going to do is we're going to take some screenshots of our footage in our timeline. So we've got this music video here by Cole Benner. So we're just going to take some screenshots like so. So guys, once we got our screenshots in Photoshop, now what we're going to do is we're just going to open up the plastic texture pack and pick this up on my website. So first of all, what we're going to do is we're going to change our image. So we're going to make sure this is a smart object and we're going to head up to filter and camera roll. And here we're just going to make some basic adjustments to our photo. So here we have our camera roll photo. Once you've made your adjustments to your image, you can then drag on your plastic texture and we can then play around with the blend modes. It really depends on the image on what blend mode you can use, but usually lighting and screen are the best ones to choose from. So for this occasion, they all look pretty good, but I think I'm gonna go with, I think I'm gonna go with color dodge on this one. And I'm just gonna lower the opacity slightly, so around 80%, so we have a cool plastic texture look over the top. So we're just gonna save this one now. Back over to Premiere Pro now. Here we have our textures, and we want them to start start around about here. Put number one on, then come one, two, three, make a cut, one, two, three, make a cut, and then one, two, three, make a cut, and delete. Drag these down. So now we should have something like this, and we're gonna add an adjustment layer. And then I'm going to come over to effects, liquid effect pack, and just drag anyone. So now we have our cool textured look, like so. So that's how we created that simple texture with just the images. But now I'm going to show you how we can create an uh, animated one. So we're going to so we're going to add in this double texture, number 25, and we're just going to scale down. And then we're going to rotate 90 degrees, and then we're going to increase so it fills up two bits of the screen. Then we're gonna resize our actual footage and then we're gonna come over to opacity and create a mask. And we're then gonna draw a mask around the side of our footage, like so. We're then gonna duplicate our bottom clip. So we're gonna hold Alt and drag up and then we're gonna move the position over to the other side. And we're gonna type in horizontal flip and drag that on. And then we're gonna come down to mask, draw around this image. So we don't have any coming over. And we're going to nest the clip. So now what we're going to do is just increase the scale of our footage, like so. And then the same on the other one, which means increase the scale. So guys, what we did there is we just added a simple flash preset. So you can pick up those on my website again. So this is the final look. So guys, I hope you did enjoy the video on how to create these plastic transition effects. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.